Apple's Tim Cook going against President Trump at the Supreme Court by going to bat for the dreamers, undocumented immigrants who came to the U.S. as children and were protected by an Obama-era order. Cook signing on to an amicus brief that's a friend of the court brief for the first time. Uh, Apple employs 443 dreamers, and the company says they eagerly sought out and hired them. Cook saying our country has enjoyed unparalleled success by welcoming people from around the world. So Tim Cook has seen eye to eye with the president on a lot of different issues recently. Uh, this is a division for now. Carol, how long do you think it continues? Well, I actually don't see it as a division with the president so much, David, as a division with Congress, who once again has failed to act. They refuse to put forth any sort of comprehensive immigration reform. And just like on any other issue that we've been talking about, USMCA, now immigration, it's hard for companies to figure out what to do. It's hard for individuals to figure out what to do when Congress won't have that type of clarity. So I agree with Tim Cook in that we need some type of clarity, and I don't think that this will go away anytime soon. Well, Tim Cook, first of all, is a brilliant uh, uh, CEO uh, working uh, for a dynamic, brilliant uh, uh, company. What I don't understand is when people that smart uh, come together and their first thought is to file an amicus brief rather than take the 443, is that correct, the number of dreamers in the employee of Apple, instead of sponsoring them and moving them into citizenship within the United States. This could have all been resolved from the time, I'm going to guess, take a median point uh, at which they joined Apple, uh, they could be citizens by now. This is an absurdity, and it's really, uh, I, I think, uh, it's a much lower standard that's being repaired to here by Apple than is uh, their norm in any other part of their business, if indeed this is part of their business. I, I have to tell you, we have been talking immigration forever. We have watched how both parties have sat around talking about it and never get anything done. The word is clarity, and the words are lack of clarity on anything. Look, these dreamers are here. Let's come up with something. Let's get it done. And it keeps just getting passed and passed and passed on. And it'll probably not get done for another few years. Yeah, you're right, Lou. They should have been citizens by now if they just move forward. But of course, everybody's just sitting there yapping, yapping, yapping away at each other. Uh, and uh, again, these people are, you suffer because of it.